What up, BNB TV? As you can see, we are in the middle of nowhere. The camera is just not working. We can't find anything to height, heighten it. It sucks. Coming on location just isn't easy. Dub, how do you do it? <laughs> what do you stand your camera on? Okay. And I'll show you guys what we are doing. We'll piece it in. It'll go whoop boom across the screen. And then, yeah, we'll do it in parts, kind of cut and, cut and paste like we have been. Stay tuned though. We also have one survival item we're gonna try. We're excited. Lucas, hopefully you think it's cool. I think it's cool. We'll see. But all right, y'all, I'm gonna get Toby out of the way and we will get the food. All right, y'all, so we are doing the Chef 5 Minute Meal, and we are going to be doing this in the desert with the view of this strip in the background. And then we also have an Ozark, which the lighting probably isn't helping on this one, but we have an Ozark. It is a collapsible water bottle. It says it can hold 16 ounces. We're super excited. Again, we're doing this with the strip in the background. The sun, though, is coming up right over that mountain. It's causing... A crazy light. <laughs> so we are totally gonna get the food out right now though. Stay tuned, you will see. All right y'all, this is all the food it comes with. You can see it's kind of on an orange tent right now. <laughs> it's slightly unfolded. But it looks like we got some royal cream crackers. Any of those ones with like vanilla cream inside. It's gonna be a surprise. Then we have some instant granola cereal with a latte, honey almond. That sounds like really cool. We're gonna try to cook that on the fire if possible. Then we have some chicken parmesan pasta. I have never had that before, it sounds yummy. And then we have a tortilla. I don't really understand a tortilla with pasta, but okay. And then we have banana chips. That sounds bomb, can't wait to try that. And then they do give you in this bag, it looks like some jelly, some like mints. It did come with a spoon, luckily, because I didn't bring a tray or silverware, so yay. And then some seasonings, I'll probably use that. I don't really understand the tortilla. That's like the one that's kind of confusing. And then they give you one of these wicked cooking bags. You just add water, I'm like super excited. We'll cook the main in that. But all right y'all, we're gonna start prepping and opening and then the next thing you'll see is some food. All right. All right y'all, so I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see but the fire is going now, yay. That thing is cooking, oh my gosh. We have our wheat tortilla, it's definitely wheat. It's like folded wheat tortilla. We have our banana chips. There was a few more, I only put a few out. And then these are the crackers. They were totally not what I was thinking. So this is, I guess, what they're calling a royal cream cracker. I don't know. So there's crackers. That makes more sense now to put jelly on this. I get it, I get it. But yeah, here's our food. We have our oatmeal cooking. All right, let's try at least the banana chip for now. We're gonna try a banana chip. Boom, yum. Mm. Okay. That is good. Mmm. Crunchy. Mmm. He spit his out. <laughs> mm. Nope. Mm -hmm. like, he's struggling with that. I have a cup. I like bananas. Banana. Mmm. <laughs> Where did that go now? Oh my gosh. Oh yeah. All right. So I got our jelly. It says mixed fruit. We're gonna put one on one of these crackers really quick. Yeah. You can see that. It's very uh, gelatinous though. It like didn't want to come off. Look at the color. The color is very orange for mixed berry. All right, we're gonna put that over there. Okay. Oh, suck. All right, look at that. Boom. Boom. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm you know, that was probably one of like the best crackers we've ever had. Mm. Mm. That's a good cracker. It's plain. Mm. That's a really good cracker. Mm-hmm. Dark looking action. With the strip. I did much better with the oatmeal. 
It's much thicker than normally when I make it. It's very watery. And I'm dumping it trying to show y'all. But yeah, I think it's ready. We're gonna try this next. Stay tuned. All right, y'all, so as you can see, we have oatmeal. It looks cooked. Oh yeah. I really, can't really tell. It says it's gonna be the like oatmeal with latte. And it said almond and something. All right. Hmm. All right. Probably cooked a little longer. Good, good. Hmm. It has a slight almond flavor. Slight almond. It's almost like you used almond milk with it or something. Hmm. Not bad. It's very, very muted, but has flavor. Hmm. Hmm. So yeah. Hmm. <laughs> Mmm. That's pretty good. Alright, we're gonna tell you a little bit. There is the Vegas Strip. Pyramid. Look at that. Yum. Yum. And there's Jasper. Look at that. Yum. Mm-hmm. It's like my zoom capabilities from the mountain. Mm -hmm. All right, you can actually read the MGM. But yeah, meow. We're way over here. All right, y'all. This is the chicken parmesan pasta. I don't know why. I was thinking probably like an Alfredo sauce, I guess, because parmesan Alfredo. But yeah, it's like totally shells. Like, they're legit shells. I wasn't expecting this. And again, I have a tortilla. What do I do with a tortilla? Oh my gosh. That is so hot. That's on fire. I mean, that was one of, like, the hottest meals I've ever made in a Flamish Fashion Eater. It's, like, literally on fire. Burned my tongue. Mmm. That is, um... That is delicious. That tastes like something you made at home or at a restaurant. It's really hot. It's very flavorful. Mmm. Good job, y'all. Mmm. That was a bite of chicken. I clearly tasted that chicken. But yeah, look at those green things in here. Some pasta shells. They're clearly shells. I mean, perfect, perfect texture. Mmm. Mm-hmm. That's good. I like it. I like it. Mmm. Bomb. I still don't get this tortilla though. Alright, I found our piece of chicken. I'll give that to Toby in a sec. He smells it. Look at him. He's like. Mmm. <laughs> Alright. Here's a piece of chicken. Chicken. I'm let him try that piece. Yeah. Came with some slobber on that. Wipe it off. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. So good. I'm gonna try a tortilla in a sec. I don't know what it was supposed to be for. All right. Mm. Mm, no, not bad. Tortillas. Mm. It's not like stale or anything. But I, I don't understand. I wouldn't put the pasta with this. It's weird. Mm. You wouldn't put oatmeal. You wouldn't put banana chips. <laughs> I wouldn't put jelly on this. I don't know. Mm. I don't understand this. Y'all. Mm. Not bad though. You're right. Mm-hmm. Mm. Overall, it's pretty good. These are bomb. That was pretty good. Not bad. This jelly was okay. We had the color though. Mm. I'm intrigued. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna make the drink and we're gonna do it in our new uh collapsible container. <laughs> Stay tuned. Okay, y'all, we're gonna try this right now. Collapsible water bottle. It did come with a nifty, has like a hook. I'll show you guys on my backpack, like I have little kind of spots where we can hang it when we're done. But yeah, how's the hook, has the lid, and then this thing, poof, 
Look at that. It went from short to huge. All right. So we, I tried to use, which I didn't really tell y'all, but the the matches I used were British, and it's going to go with this British drink, raspberry. They didn't give us a drink in that pack. Kind of lame. I guess you don't need that to survive. All right, so we're going to pour all of this raspberry in. Um, I don't know if y'all have seen our other videos. I am in love with all of the British British drinks. They know how to make a mean drink. All right, so I'm going to pour all the water in. It says this container can hold up to 16 ounces. We're going to screw this lid on. Bam. Now we're going to try to give this thing a shake. I will say, it's very wobbly. Like, it's blah, 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 blah. Like, <laughs> Ooh, that is good. I will say that. Hold on, let me try to get you guys an angle. Oh my gosh, take you a drink of it. That was awkward. Okay, so here's the drink. Watch me try to bend it. <laughs> it kind of bends with it. Mm. Oh, that raspberry is so good. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's so cool. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Take your lid. Stick your lid back on. I guess if you were done with it, you could just, like, you know, you'd push it down, but there's air and obviously liquid. But I'll show you guys on the backpack how cool. Let's see. All right. Look out, Bubba. Look out. All right. I'll hold on a sec. You're gonna not have a view for it. Okay, so, on this like new handed dende backpack I got, it's really, really wicked. It has little clips. I mean, it has clips everywhere, but. So you can clip it on, so I can like just hang and carry it. I mean, look at it. But yeah, it's super funny, it's super funny. But it's so cool though, because then yeah, when we're done, we can just hold it up, be done with it. But yeah, I think, we have about hit it on this video, y'all. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned for more. We have ton more survival. We got a whole bunch in. We got this really cool stove thing. I'm gonna make a fire. We're gonna do it tomorrow. So stay tuned. Bye, y'all. Again, like, comment, subscribe. Toby said so. Look at his stance right now. Yeah, <laughs> you're silly. All right, he's ready to go walk. He is said. It's time. Was that good food, Bubba? What'd you think? Did you like it? Say chicken. Chicken. See ya, guys. Too, look at that. Pulls right back up. You, know, you pull it. Let's pull it all back. Now it's a tinier little container. You can hold until you need it. It's really cool.